Win is a win. We'll take the win because uh, that certainly helps us in our morale. But uh, we should have done much better than that. But this is like a good uh, pre-training or precursor to the tournament. But we can't take these wins and go with that confidence and say that we are going to do better. We have to nail what we have to do at those very moments. So I believe uh, what we need to do is, is be more proactive in those moments where we felt that in some of the crucial moments, even in the last game, that we didn't uh, sort of capitalize on that. And uh, hopefully we'll do, uh, we'll take that to the tournament and do well in the tournament in those areas. Yeah, every match is, match is strong. Well, every match is important for us. Every match is a, a hard match for us. We talk about their strengths first, the opposition strengths first, and then we see whether we are braced enough, braced up enough to sort of uh, play them. So that's how we have gone about in the past, and that's what we will do. We'll take it match by match. We'll take it moment by moment and we'll try to sort of come on trumps uh, in those very small moments. I suppose every team who is here will have a crack at the cup. So uh, our expectations also would be that in the back of our minds. I'm sure it's a dream for all. And as I said in another, uh, another interview, well, 96, I'm sure most of them would have played just to not only to participate, but to come into a semi-final. But we did more than that and uh, thankfully we became champs that year. So uh, it's in the back of our minds to win the World Cup, but we don't, we don't want to go there. We'll take it match by match, as I said, we'll take it portion by portion. And those small moments, as I said, we would want to sort of win those first to win the match and then think about whether it's the semi-finals or not. That was, that was really important. Uh, I believe uh, Nilakshi and Hassani coming through was really good and that would certainly build up, well, build up their confidence. And uh, that, that is certainly huge. And uh, we just wanted some of the others also to come up uh, really high, well, well in their confidence, high in their confidence, but uh, well, maybe it might come in the tournament itself. Yeah, I mean, she's one of our key bowlers and uh, it's just that for our combinations, we need to see whether we can fit everybody in. Unfortunately, we can only have 11, but she's certainly a, a contender to be in the 11. Uh, she went through a certain patch in the past three, four months, but she's come through strongly and uh, we would uh, need to know what sort of combination we need for each of those matches. She's certainly right up there at the moment. No, no, well, she's a person who's a very resilient person and uh, she'll come through okay. So, but we need to work on a few things, few uh, basic aspects of things, we discussed it. And uh, maybe sometimes we tend to forget those basic necessities, so to speak. And uh, well, we discussed a few just now, well, just after this game and uh, we'll, we'll try to nail it, but it's not a concern where she's, she's done so well and she can sort of just come and just damage any team. So we leave it like that, but we will also work on things which we have to work on, small things with her, which might uh, help her to rekindle her form. Yeah, well, I've only had information of that and we saw some matches which was played in the in in the recent times we saw south africa playing uh, afghanistan and uh, yeah but still we talk of adaptability and adjustment and things like that so i think these two matches really uh, helped us in that in a way because one match was a different wicket and this match was totally different so saja like we are we are sort of ready because we've got another practice session outside of the wickets, so it's not the same simulation which we would have, but uh, I would say that uh, we are ready for adaptation, we'll, we'll adapt and try to do our very best uh, in those moments.